Hello everybody and welcome back to Season 24 of the Pokemon NASCAR Series. Today we're here at the legendary Ontario Motor Speedway in California. First of two races here in the, in the Golden State. The other one being at Auto Club. That's our next race. Alex Hawking starts on the pole. And the last two races have been pretty exciting. They have been wreck fests, but... They've had both had close finishes to the line, so we're hoping for another one here. This time, ending it under the green. This is a legendary track that existed in real life, but it's no longer, well, it's no longer there. That's unfortunate, but we brought it back here for NR Sound 3. That's the power of NR Sound 3. You can bring back any track you please. And we're going to bring back, in this case, Ontario. Kramika Jazz and smokes up at the start. We're green at Ontario. By the way, let's look at where, well, Daniel Royals starting in the back of the pack. He was our last winner, by the way, back at Vegas, collecting his second win of the season. More importantly, that win would lock him up as a two-time winner. And a big crash. Big crash in the back already right off the gate. This is a 25 lap race, increased from 20 laps because I wanted to at least get a green flag run in. And Hawkins pulls away, oh, these drivers are in the wall, no, 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 oh, there's a spin, there's a spin. And the 47, if that's William Brock spinning, bigger wreck, drivers wrecking to start the race, just, just been a wild wild first lap just an insane first lap here at Ontario but well, we made it to 25 just in case if well we get a green flag run but it appears that it may not be the case all well, the wrecking that happened on this track it just may not be the case and there's the first wreck that's not all the wrecks that this track had provided on the very first lap of the race. Here it is. Here's another wreck. Right here. James Richardson just spins out the 47 of William Brock. Big crash, big wrecks. Let's see how many drivers are out. Wow. Not as much as I thought it would be. Nine drivers are out of the race. And Hudson just added to the list. We had pit stops and the new leader is now... Abby Sachs. We'll see how long these guys will go before they start wrecking again. Green flag. Right off the bat, Grayson Acevedo takes the lead, and Avi Sachs drops really fast. Man, the high line in this track is just terrible, so the only way to go is low. Low is the only way to go at this track. Oh man, the, the high line is just real tight. No wonder these cars keep wrecking. And we have another spin. Sonomar Jr. spins out. And a big pile up in the back. That's going to take out a lot more drivers. Oh, wow. That's why this, there's been so many wrecks. The high line in this track is just too... It's just... You just can't run it. You just really cannot race in the high line. It just... It's bad. It's really bad. So the only way to go is low. But even then, when drivers get forced up high by passes, they can't control their wheel, apparently. It just becomes a problem for these cars. That's what makes this track extremely difficult, even though it's an oval. So it's really tight on the high line, so they're trying the best they can to really stay on the grip. But sometimes things happen, and it just can't be controlled. 
this track still pretty good because it does provide some close racing when it does happen. So I gotta get praise for that. Oh, no, no. Oh, there they go. Two, two teammates spin on the, on the grass. But wait a minute, we're still green? We're not. Three cars wrecked. Oh, wow. Just wow. I mean, I could tolerate this track because of its close races to the caution, but, well, it just, it's going to happen all the time, so we'll try the best we can. We're just, just trying the best. And I don't think anybody's retired, so nobody's retired. They're going to stay alive. And Max Skinner leads us to the green with 10 laps to go. So pit stops won't be a problem for these guys. Now the question is, will they stay out of wrecking each other? Green flag, Skinner gets a good jump. Auto Club will surely be much better than Ontario, but... My goodness. This has just been a mess. A complete mess. Skinner pulls away. They're going to hit the wall. And there they go. Lawler spins, Payne Beasley spins, no wait, not Payne Beasley, I should say Jared Lewis spins, and it's going to be Skinner leading, so we're not even going to look back at a replay at that. More spins, and now let's get back to the green. Don't think we'll, come, we'll be coming back to this track anytime soon after this season, but it was fun anyway while it lasted. Nicky Maxwell leads! To the cost? Wow! Five to go, she took the lead. Oh no, she hits the wall, Acevedo leads! What an unusual, unusual battle. It's not gonna be another photo finish race to the caution this time. Now for why it can only go wrong! There they go, and there's the leaders, and that'll be the race. That is the race, folks. And the winner of this one is going to be Grayson Acevedo. He'll collect his second win of the season here at Ontario, unless if, you know, things happen. Oh, no, we're not going to get back to green. Definitely not going back to the green. Well, it was a worth a shot anyway, but coming off the final turn, Grayson Acevedo is going to collect his second win of the season here in Ontario, California. Oh well, it was a rack fest. Didn't have a close finish this time. I guess I'm tired of this track with always becoming rack fest. There's just no way around it. This track is a complete rack fest. So, yeah. It's all gone. Anyway, Grayson Acevedo is the winner for the second time this season. He is locked into the chase. And 21 cars finished this race. At least it just barely missed becoming half the field um, wrecking out. So, But still 21 cars left in this race. That's just a little overkill for wrecking here today. But anyway... We'll see you guys in our next race at Auto Club Speedway. It will surely be much better than what you saw at Ontario. And I've officially given up on this track. Hope, well, what it was fun while it lasted. So, see you guys later at Auto Club.